everyone. This is Ms. Ruiz here at um, HSA at MMS. I hope that you all had a wonderful holiday break and that you are ready to start the new year um, back at school again. Now, um, we all know that with all the changes that we have going on, we have one this first week back, this first week coming back to school. So instead of, um, let me just clear up. We do have school tomorrow, January 5th. Tuesday, January 5th, we do have school. It will look like a remote learning. So this week from January 5th, 5th, 6th, 7th, and 8th, we will have school virtually. We will meet in our um, teams online. So be sure to um, log on to see your teachers on their live feed. So let me just pause by saying this. If you're in eighth grade, you will now be, instead of going to Mr. Irvin, you will be seeing Ms. Calderon for science. So for example, eighth graders, be sure everybody, whether you're six, seven, or eighth, be sure to go to your canvas and check any announcements that your teachers may be giving you. Okay, so if you're in eighth grade, this is your schedule, your homeroom, your first block, then you come to me or Jim, then your third block and your fourth block. So you meet with Miss Muski first and you make sure that you log on her teams, right? You guys make sure that you go to your teams with, with your teacher, with Miss Muski. Then you go to me. We log on at, if you're not sure, you don't remember, you want to make sure that you log on to your Canvas page. So you're with me at 1030, but we log in at 1045, right? And then on third block, I think you go to Miss Sailors. And then after Miss Sailors, you would go to Miss Calderon. Your fourth block is with Miss Calderon. So please, please, please don't say, oh, I didn't know how to do this. Okay? Please don't do that. You have to check your announcements. I've already had many responsible eighth graders text me and say, Miss Reese, what are we doing on, on, do we have school? What are we doing? That's very good to be proactive. Okay? Very good to be proactive. That's in our book, right? In the seven habits, it tells you to be proactive, not reactive. So I want to make sure that we're all going to be on the same page tomorrow. Also, your teachers are going to be calling you and your parents to let you know what the expectation is, okay? So the expectation is that tomorrow, on Tuesday, January 5th, if this is your schedule, eighth grade, okay? you log on through your live feed, okay? Now, if you're seventh grade, if you're in seventh grade, this is your uh, your schedule, okay? First block, your first block should be Miss Pernas, okay? Then you go to lunch, recess. Then your second block is, I'm trying to think, who's your second block? It's either Mr. Lewis. Yes, it's well, it's not going to be Mr. Lewis anymore. It's going to be Miss Polk. OK, Miss Polk is now your second block teacher because she's your science teacher for the next semester, semester two. And then you come to me, right, to Miss Ruiz. So at one o'clock, I know that our class starts at 1247, but online we meet up at one o'clock. I'll have it open before one o'clock if you want to log in. That's no problem. You know that that always happens. Um, and then your last block is Miss Clark. So you go to Miss Clark's class, but you have to log in on Teams. Okay? So no more Mr. Lewis. You go to Miss Polk. Okay? Then if you're in sixth grade, if you're in sixth grade, your first block is Mr. G. 
the majority of you, not all of you, um, is Mr. G. Then your second block, I want to say, is Miss Rogers. Well, now you're not going to go to Miss Rogers. You're going to go to Mr. Blakeney, which is your science teacher. Then you have um, your third block, which is Miss Ivanich. And then you come to me at, uh, we're going to log in at 2.15, okay? So, that being said, if you have any questions at all, any questions, make sure that you use your inbox to write to your teachers, okay? You write to your teachers, okay? Okay, you write your teachers and then you send it, okay? And you can write us through um, our inbox in Canvas. You can write us through our email. If you have our phone number, you can call or text with any questions. We are working from home today and we're gonna be working all week. Now, I know that we have a lot of changes going on, but I wanna make sure that you guys are well aware of what, what we need to do. Also, I wanna tell you that um, there is lunch being served this week, okay? And I'll, so at our school, uh, let me just, hold on. Maybe I should go to the R. Monroe Middle School. Hold on. Mm -hmm. Give me a second. There was a message that was sent out about lunches, and I just want to make sure that everybody knows that lunch is available. I just want to make sure that I give you the right time. So here it is. Now look at this. Um, free breakfast and lunch for all students until, okay. So that's not the one I want. Um, oh, congratulations, Miss Lewis, Teacher of the Year. Um, honor roll, congratulations to those people. So look, at, if you don't have internet, remember what I've told you in the past. If you... I don't want to hear any more excuses about I don't have Wi-Fi, I don't this, I don't that. Look at all these places that have internet where you can go and um, use their internet in order, you know, to be able to do your school from 9.30 to 12.30 and on Fridays from 7.30 to 2, okay? Um, let me go to the next one. It's even in Spanish, guys, so we, okay? Um, I know that we have it in here because they sent it, they sent it yesterday. Well, we may not have updated it, but there's going to be, I think it's from 11 to 1, uh, the same schedule where you have your free, your, your lunch is available. I'll have to double check and I can send it to you guys, but lunch is available um, for you so you can come pick up your lunch with your families, okay? If you have any questions at all, please feel free to contact myself, Ms. Santos, Ms. Chatila, or Ms. Maria, okay? I am hoping that 2021, semester two, is going to be much better um, for all of us. And we, what did I say at the beginning of the year? What's our word? Flexible, flexibility. We have to be flexible this year because we have changes. Things can happen overnight and we just have to be able to catch up and pick right back up where we left off. Okay, guys? So I am hopeful that we are going to have a really good semester and that, um, and re please remember that we're always here to help you. Okay, thank you, and I hope to see you tomorrow on our live session. Bye.